Here's how to set up a legacy ID on your iPad. And a legacy ID is basically a way that people can access your data after you've died. You have to give them permission first though, and this is how it works. Uh, this is from a help page on the Apple website. And basically go to your settings on your iPad, uh, go to the sign in area, so tap your name, and then you'll see an option under the security that says legacy contact setup, so tap that. And basically at that point, you'll have a couple of options. One of them is if you have family sharing set up, you can designate an existing family member to have access to your data. Note that in the US, you need to be 13 or over to actually go through the process of accessing the data, but you can even set up someone who's not that age yet if you need to. If the person does not have an Apple ID, basically you'll provide an email address or a telephone number uh, then you'll need to print out an access key and they'll be able to, they need to be able to have access to that as along with your death certificate in order to access your Apple information, which includes things like messages, photos, things that you've, uh, certain things that you've purchased, but not your purchasing information.